Hello Gemini, welcome to your weekly reading. I hope you're all doing really well. This reading is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign Gemini. And if you like this reading, please like, subscribe, comment and share the content if that's what you feel like doing. I really appreciate you all for all your support on my channel. And for private reading specific to you, please visit katietarot.com. So let's take a look, Gemini, at your week ahead. Calling in your angels and guides, spirit and source energy for Gemini. This reading is just general in nature. It's not going to be specific to answer all of your questions. So please just take what resonates for you personally and leave what doesn't. This is where you're at currently Gemini this is what's below you behind you above you and coming in towards you let's take a look at your first message support beautiful and it says people come into your life for many different reasons some you learn from and then they move on while others return often because you need to learn more from those individuals others remain beside you throughout your entire life so I'm seeing here that it could be vice versa. This could be you and you may be requiring support this week or just energetically around you currently. Or it could be another person. You could be offering support to another person. I'm also seeing that there may be some people or a person that is leaving your life. And I feel that this is confirmation from spirit for you if you are troubled by this person leaving. Um, it's confirmation to you to know that it's meant to be. This person is meant to be. You've learned your lessons from this person and now they're moving on. I'm also seeing that new opportunities are on the horizon for you when it comes to connections. So networking or connections with others romantically or in another way perhaps. It's very strong and it depends on your individual circumstances. But I'm seeing a very positive energy here. Working with others, connecting with others or another person. Now, I am also being shown here that someone's acting, someone's acting in love or they're acting interested in you when perhaps there's a hidden agenda or there is an underlying um, benefit for them uh, to be interested in you. So just look out for those energies as well. So let's take a look at these cards. We have the key, successful outcome to your problems. Yes, you've got um, the key here. So doors are opening for you. It could be a new opportunity coming in for you or there's going to be a successful outcome in your life this week or very soon. The broken bridge, unsuccessful outcome to a problem. Isn't that interesting? We have successful outcome and then unsuccessful outcome. So this week or the energy around you, so coming up in the next few weeks perhaps, there's going to be a door opening here and a door closing here. Perhaps they are reliant on each other. Perhaps something has to end before something can begin. That's very interesting. We have the wheel, indecisiveness, allowing your life to ramble aimlessly. So make sure there's a purpose. Um, and I feel that you are getting more on purpose um, this week. I really feel that, Gemini. I feel that um, if you have been indecisive about a decision or a choice, then this week I feel the energy is very supporting of you to make a make a positive change or, or a good choice here. We have the club. Someone will try to make you do something against your will. So just look out for that. Perhaps that's what I was picking up on here with the support energy. Someone's acting. Okay, they're not showing their true colors. Um, you may or may not know who this is. It could be someone you work with, someone in your family or in your social circle perhaps. Um, but if it doesn't feel intuitively right for you to do this thing, then perhaps you need to um, just pull away from it. Perhaps what this, this is what the broken bridge is here, unsuccessful um, outcome, um, because you need to say no. So something, the bridge needs to come down on that relationship or on that particular scenario. That's what I'm seeing here for some of you. 
Um, there's one more card here. We have the rainbow. The most difficult part of a situation is over. So this week there's going to be um, there's going to be a change for the better. The difficult part, whatever this is, because I can see some challenges here for you. Um, this difficult part here is going to be open and I feel that's what this key is saying here. Spirit is saying, look, you've got some things to work out with a particular person um, or a situation in your life, but things are going to be okay. This may be the most difficult part and then you're moving on from this and you're going to have a successful outcome. Doors are going to open for you. Opportunities are going to come through and problems will be resolved. Let's take a look at your next message. Transformation. Yes, perfect. You're in a transformation stage right now. And perhaps that's why you need some support because it can be difficult to move from one area of life into another, especially if you feel comfortable, but you're definitely transcending the difficulties here. So this is a beautiful energy, actually. You, you're, you're changing into a better you or a better circumstance. So this is really um, very, very, very positive. Let's take a look at this message. Fire elemental beautiful so Gemini you're getting your passion back here there could be an intense um, energy for someone or for something coming um, and coming into your life and you feeling it this week or or very soon it says I ignite the fire within me that connects me to the divine so of course there's that there's that spiritual element coming into play where you're connecting into your divine purpose you're very authentic in what you say, what you do, how you act, and you're on fire with things. You know, you're really moving forward. You know, it's they're showing me an unstoppable energy. So you're unstoppable, even though you may have some challenges, you're unstoppable. You're moving forward with positivity and you're just going to get things done. You're transforming through the challenges. And that's extremely, extremely powerful and it's going to have a good outcome for you. The Seven of Stars. So this is um, success, the seven of wands. Have faith and you're going to be very successful through this, through this change. Um, opportunities will come your way. And I feel that you're going to understand um, the people that really support you, the people that are really there for you. They're going to come out of the woodwork this week or very soon and the people that aren't are going to fall away. So it's, there's an awakening here to who's really on your side and who isn't. We have the magician, impulse. This is a great energy to lead up to the current circumstance here because the magician is about manifestation. So you having the ability to manifest what you want in your life and being successful in your endeavor. That's what these cards are showing. So what you, and we've also got the butterfly here, the transformation that was coming up for you. Um, so we have that, a new start transformation and you being very successful. So overall very positive cards and energies coming through and the queen of angels the visionary um, the queen of angels indicates that you may have drawn back your emotions you may have um, contained yourself or your energies um, toward a particular person or a situation so then you can have a higher vision then you can see things from above rather than being enmeshed in drama or enmeshed in a circumstance which may be confusing that's how I'm seeing this and by by taking this stance by being more in your mind logical pulling away from the emotions um, I feel that you have regained your passion regained your sense of um, fire and and that powerful energy that that may have been that may have been lacking or may have um, being left behind in, in a circumstance in your life. I feel that there's been some trauma or difficulty um, with a relationship or in your life in some way and it's affected you in, in a heartfelt way and it's also dampened down your light and your fire and your exuberance and your joy and your passion for someone or something. And so I'm seeing you're moving away from that now, which is, which is really nice. You're regaining the passion. The three of trees, dedication, yes, beautiful. This is a, the earth energy, so um, something tangible is going to change here. Something is going to change and 
something's going to be um, built up from scratch or maybe if you're still if you're working on something it's going to be built upon what you already have and there's new um, new horizons for you new solid horizons that you're building upon this can also mean contracts agreements and and um, and trade or something um, something like this for some of you and the knight of trees the custodian beautiful so so this is a very solid energy reliable um, very very honest reliable sure of yourself um, there may be an earth sign around you as well um, but this energy as you is very stable and you're slowly but surely um, moving toward your goal here and see the fire is in alignment now your, your purpose your passion your goals you're aware of them and and I'm, and I'm also seeing that you're aware of the support around you or not okay people that will show their true colors this week or very soon and you'll be very it'll put you in a good position to move forward and be successful so i hope you all have a wonderful week ahead and i'll talk to you all again soon